The reason that I stress authenticity so much in my videos is because there's literally nothing more important than, first of all, having that sense of integrity and knowing who you are, what your goals are, what you want to do in life. And until you have that sense, everything that you do, everything that you learn, that you study is sort of a waste of time because it doesn't matter if you think, oh, this is, you know, this is what's going to make me happy or, you know, this is the information I need. As long as you're not coming from that place where you know who you are and you know what you want in life, you're just going to chase after everything that looks shiny. So some people make the mistake, for example, of um, looking for uh these things out of desperation or inspiration like i did for example when i found dan pena uh, i didn't go there because i felt good about my life I, I went there because i felt like shit and i thought that you know the solution would be to get like really really ostensibly rich rich um the first moment i think i really knew who i am was about half a year ago when i just sat at the beach literally just sat at the beach sorry for the dog barking uh literally just sat at the beach for i don't know five hours six seven hours and i have that sense of anxiety you know like everybody does and as long as you have it um the the analogy is that it's like it's like a, a calculator and the calculator is basically stuck on the number seven so whatever you enter into it three four or five you know it, whatever you calculate it's stuck on the number seven so you get false calculations and when you spend these hours by yourself by the way the reason i do a meditation 60 minutes a day is because i get that 10 20 minute at the end of perfect amazing clarity that gives me insight into what I truly want from life so for 20 minutes just 20 minutes of my day I know who I am and I know what I want but when you go to the beach like I tell you to do you get maybe you know after five six hours of, of meditation and when I say meditation I mean just sitting still basically you get that half an hour it's like a cheat code you get that half an hour of of knowing who you are and in that half an hour you basically get all the answers that you need it's like your true self comes out because suddenly you don't feel that anxiety anymore like oh my god what the fuck you know life is so horrible life is so difficult what about this what about that and it's like you gain a, an altitude over your life, finally. So, again, that's why I, I emphasize the importance of doing it so much. And that's also why it's so fucking difficult to do, is because there's so much um, incentive not to do it, because your brain is going to resist it, your ego maybe is going to resist it, it's going to tell you, oh no this is more important or it's going to make you feel resistant you know it's going to put up distractions anything but you know sitting alone and being by yourself because your brain wants to keep you in the shit it wants to keep you in the state of coping and um you have a choice like do you stay there or do you take action to get out of it so i choose to take this action every day by meditating I uh, granted, like I said in the previous video, I committed to doing 60 minutes a day. Now I only do 20. So even I'm escaping it a bit. But, you know, I'm going back to it right now. And, um, yeah. <laughs> I mean, go to the fucking beach or the forest. Be alone. Be alone with yourself for at least a few hours. At least five or six hours. And the reason I say so much time is because it's like a cheat code. It makes sure, it guarantees that you're going to get an epiphany. It makes sure that you're going to reach that point where the anxiety disappears because it's just too much time, uh, you know, for, for it not to disappear. So it might take an hour, it might take three hours, it might take six hours. 
it might take 10 I don't know but when it disappears you'll finally have clarity about what you want in life because you'll finally be thinking without that seven number pressed so you'll be able to think and it's gonna be rational and clear and that's how you'll know who you are and that's how you will know what you want to do so anything else you do except for that is could almost be judged as a complete waste of time even if you build up something amazing you might find out you didn't even want it so uh, please do that okay for yourself make Make time for a day of clarity. Take, you know, a day off work, whatever. Just do some, you know, whatever it takes. Find a way to, to find that day. You know, I'm, I'm even rhyming. Find a way to take that day where you just don't do anything and just go to the forest without your phone and just sit down and, and be. And out of that are going to come the, all the answers that you need to know what you want to do with your life. Hope you do it. And if you have trouble with it, let me know because my point in life is helping you do it. Thanks for watching.